Hello. All right, guys, this video I'm making right now is to help you out with any buffering issues, lagging issues, or freezing issues like that. All right, guys, um, I know some of y'all have been noticing the longer you have a device, the more it starts to give you a little bit of issues. Okay, so we're going to try to fix that today. All right, now, I am using the T95 Android box right now. Now, understand that everybody's device is a little bit different, okay? So, I am going to give you the instructions, all right? How I tell you to get somewhere may be a little bit different when you're with your cell phone than it is with this T95, but you can still do it. The steps are the same. All right, so the first thing you want to do is you want to reset everything, all right? How you do that is the first thing you're going to do is you're going to unplug your Wi-Fi router, all right, so wherever that is in your house, you're going to go find your Wi-Fi router and you're going to unplug that. Now, when I say unplug, I mean from the back of the device. Don't just unplug it from the wall. Take the power cord from the back of the device and pull it out. All right. Once you've done your router, then you're going to go around and you're going to do all your devices that you watch uh, One Bell TV on. Whether it's an Android box, whether it's a Fire Stick, you're going to go pull out those uh, power cords from the back. And once you've done that, you're going to leave everything unplugged and off for about five or ten minutes. Okay, so don't just unplug it and plug it right back up. You need to give it a good five or ten minutes unplugged before you uh, plug it back in. All right, so once you've given it your five or ten minutes, the first thing you need to go do, excuse me, is go over to settings. All right, so I'm going to settings. Okay, that little gear at the bottom on the uh, diamond on the left-hand side, that's your settings. And then I'm going to go to the right to more settings, and I'm going to open that up. All right, I'm going to go to where it says apps. I'm going to open that up, and then I'm going to go to where it says see all apps. All right, so basically, you want to get to your all apps column, okay? However your device does it, you want to get to your all apps column, and then you're going to open that up. Now, that is all your apps. The next thing you're going to do is you got to go app by app. All right. You're going to just click it open. It's going to give you some options. The first option you want to do is for stop. All right. So I'm going to click for stop. It's going to ask me, am I sure? I'm going to click OK. All right. The next thing you want to do, again, same app. You're going to go down to where it says clear cache. All right. Now, I'm going to say something very important here. You're only going to clear the cache. Do not clear data. I'll say that again. Do not clear data. Only clear the cache. All right. If you clear data, that's going to wipe out everything in that app. For instance, this is my One Bell TV Max app. So that will wipe out all my favorites, username, password. It will wipe all that stuff out and it'll just be a clear app again to where you can start over. All right, so you do not want to clear data. You want to clear cache. All right, so I'm going to click it. Same thing. It's going to ask me am I sure. Click OK. And then it cleared my cache out. It cleaned it out a little bit. All right, and once I've done that, I'm going to hit the back button. <clears throat> and then you're just going to go down every app, guys. All right, there's a lot of these apps that's holding a lot of stuff that you never knew it was holding. So you're going to go down every app, hit four stop, hit clear cache. All right. Once you've done that for every app, you're going to go back to your home page. You're going to open up One Bell TV. All right. So I'm open up One Bell Max. And once you get it open, you're going to update all of your uh, categories. So I'll start with live TV. OK, now you see the live TV circle is red. All I'm going to do is I'm going to go down one where it says last updated and I'm going to click on that. And then it'll start updating my live TV again. So you want to do that with uh, live TV, movies, and series. All right. <clears throat> and once you've done that, guys, that's pretty much it. Everything should be running better after that. Um, okay. So once you're done, like I said, you're complete there. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to pause the video. And I am going to show you what this looks like on the Fire Stick. One more thing, guys, if you're still using the old Bell TV and Star Max uh, system, please, we got to get you over to one Bell Max. That'll make things a lot easier as far as explaining stuff and showing you how it works. All right. So if you're still using that system, all right, we got to try to get you over to one Bell Max. 
Okay. Now, that's how you clear it out on the Android box. What I'm going to do is I'm going to pause. I'm going to start up a fire stick and I'll show you real fast how you uh, clear out a fire stick. All right, guys, you see we got the uh, home page of the fire stick here. So I'm just going to show you this real quick. Already explained everything. So once your fire stick connects back to the Internet, all right, you're going to go all the way to the right. And that's going to take you to the uh, settings. All right. So I'm going to go all the way to the right to my settings. All right. And then I'm going to go down to where it says applications. Open that up. And then I am going to go to manage installed apps. Open that up. And then there you go. So basically this is how you get to all apps on your Fire Stick. All right. So once I get there, again, one by one, you're going to open up the apps. You're going to hit four stop. Now notice on the Fire Stick when I hit four stop, it didn't ask me if I wanted, if I was sure. It just four stop. All right, and then I'll go down. Once again, I'm gonna skip data and I'm gonna clear cache. Do not clear your data from any app. All right, same thing. Once I click it, it doesn't ask me any questions. It just go ahead and it clears data. All right, I know it's hard to see, but you can see now my cache, excuse me, it clears the cache, not the data. As you can see now, my cache is at zero bytes. All right, so that's how you do it on the Fire Stick. Now I'm gonna back out. And then you just go down to the next app. All right, same thing, four stop, clear cache, and then you can move on to the next app. All right, once you go down all those apps, you're gonna open up your One Bell TV Max, and you're gonna update your live TV movies and series, and then everything should be good to go from there. Thank you.